in today's video i will be showing you how to take your kids lunches to another level this is called hot dog rolls and it's quite easy to do and your kids are going to be grateful for trying something new and interesting so let's jump right in and work on these hot dog rolls welcome back this is kind of a typical work with me let's do lunches for the kids so here i got hot dogs this is chicken hot dogs and i turned on my cooktop and i put a ceramic pot on the cooktop i poured some oil on the on the on the pot and then i just tried to make sure the the oil even out or spread on the pot and then i put my 12 hot dogs in the pot so I want my hot dogs to cook or to get to a good level so I just want them to to, to not be I hear it's already been, been cooked kind of processed but I want it to cook again because why not so I put in the 12 hot dogs um as you can see my cooktop is on so i just let it sit there while i turn it around to make sure it evens out the cooking evens out you don't want one side to be too burnt and the other side not done so just continue to do this slowly if you're here for your first time hello and welcome you're going to love it right here as i upload videos every week with interesting contents so if you haven't subscribed please go ahead and hit the red subscribe button turn your post notification bell such that when next i upload a video you'll be notified and you'll be the first to watch so let's continue to work on this now the hot dogs are ready kind of golden brown and that's what i like and i took them out of the pot so i took everything out of the pot and now let's work on what we will be using first i will be using two eggs i cracked two eggs in a bowl an empty bowl and then a quarter cup of milk using a spatula i mix that together one teaspoon vanilla extract i mix that i mix that again together about one teaspoon sugar or just about a pinch of sugar if that's fine by you and i continue to mix as well so now i added about a teaspoon sorry one tablespoon of flour you can go up to about two tablespoons this is just me being interesting you can choose not to add this if you want that's fine then like a pinch of salt or a quarter teaspoon of salt so that's it that's it for the mixture i set that aside now i start with the loaf with the sliced bread sorry so i took one slice bread using my rolling pin i rolled it out to really flatten up then i took one hot dog i rolled the hot dog with the bread and i dipped it in the liquid that i made earlier yep and then i put that in the pot just continue to watch as I do this it's quite easy again you want the, the slice of bread to be really thin you really want it to be really thin so you have to really roll hard it's quite easy to do like I said earlier it's quite easy to do if this is something you've seen before or you've tried before let me know in the comment section let me know if, if, if this is something you're going to be trying, if you found it interesting, found it helpful. My kids really love it. So the first time I tried it, they were like, oh, mommy, this tastes so good. So I, I try doing this every week. So for their lunches, I have what I have something different I do every day. And I switch it up as soon as I try something new and I see that it's quite easy for me to do. And it's something that the kids are going to love, right? Because at the end of the day, it's for the kids. You want them to have something in school. You want them to be able to eat something at school. So again, this is all for the kids. 
so once i was done um um working on all 12 hot dogs rolling them with the slices of bread this is how it looked like and then i took that to the cooktop i turned the over i turned the cook the cooktop on to about medium and i just um just continued to watch and i used um, a tongue to just turn it around to make sure it doesn't get too brown on one side so that is how it's, it looked like so just keep turning around so all the sides cook and this is almost ready don't you like what you see i truly love the end result yeah again you all watch these videos but you haven't subscribed please do subscribe this is the end result so is like i told you earlier this is so easy i did this for a short and people liked it so I decided to make a long video so you guys are going to understand how I did this. It's quite easy like I said. So here was I setting up the kids lunches. I did just I took one slice and I divided it into two. That is how it looked like and I really love this so much. It was quite easy to do and again the kids loved it so that is a big win for me. Usually when they don't love it, then it means you, you cannot really do much, right? You have to try something else. So when they loved it, I was so happy. So again, let me know if you're going to be trying this in the comment section. It's quite easy. And yeah, it was fun having you around. Follow me while I make um, lunches for my kids. And I really love the outcome. The lunches are ready to go. And the kids are all ready to go to school too. So I have three kids, so it's quite interesting. If you missed last week's video where I showed you how to make this amazing scotch egg using corn fish, please check the link above to watch. You're going to learn something. It's quite interesting. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget life can get bitter. Eat hot dog rolls to make it sweet. Until next week, bye.